Crane's. Do we just kill Crane? What do I do? That motherfucking piece of Crane. shit! Crane? Ugh, God, you'd think you'd know a person. Bigby, you have to tell her. I know! <laughs> What's going on? What did you find up there? You know, other than the... I just need to find Snow. In a Why? In story of the What's going of on? Sleepy Hollow. Shit! Crane's been... Ugh. Oh, Bigby, calm down. Everything's going to be fine, okay? It's going to be fine. That perverted little fucker right after Snow. I need Milo. to find her right now. Okay, oh. Okay, it's, it's going to be okay. Where did you see her last? Did she say where she was going? She took Holly to the business office to prepare for the funeral. Lily's funeral? Yeah. How do you know? I was just at the trip trap, and I heard Gren telling some folks about a funeral at the Buckingham the Bridge. trip trap? Are you drinking? When? Right now. They were on their way out. Bigby! Wait. What? Snow's... Snow's been through a lot. There are things she doesn't talk about. Just... Please be careful when you tell her. And you should tell her. But... Beauty, I have to go. Just... Wait a second and listen. This is important. You know how you felt when you saw that picture? Well, it's going to be yeah, much Marlon. worse for her. Yeah, I'm just remember that. Yeah, and the magic of the creatures that you read about, 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 το είπε και το είπε και αυτή. Γιατί είπε ότι κόπηκε στη μέση η μουσική. Yeah. Random, randomly. Okay, let's see now. Not now. If you're here, then you were part of a very special circle. People she trusted and cared for. I won't um, offend you by claiming one day that, that the pain of losing Lily will ever subside. I know as well as you that it will never subside. But I also know that, that the memory of Lily will sustain as well. And it will, in time, equal in strength to our mourning her loss. And it is in that spirit that I'd like to talk about what you've all been so grateful to share with me. Your memories of her. How she could be stubborn and patient, rash and thoughtful. How she carried a torch for the old ways, for tradition, for hmm. um, pageantry. And most of all, it seems how Lily loved dearly loved her friends and family. She loved being around them, in good times and bad. I oh. never met Lily, but from what I've been told, oh, I know in my heart oh, that she would have liked to be here tonight. Uh, Mr. And Toad. now we'll have our um, moment of silence. Oh. Thank you. Nay, I'm the same Paramethio Toad with Crane. Moments of silence, when do I speak with him? Bigby, is everything okay? No, not you. Holly, it's... He wasn't fucking invited. Holly, wait. He has no right to be here. Not after what he did. Look, Holly, I'm not here to start trouble. You throw my sister down the witching well, and you have the nerve to show your face here? After you lie? After you promise me? Holly, wait. That was Crane. Just Crane. He disposed of Lily's body before Big B could do anything about it. I'm telling you the truth. Don't cover for him. But this genuinely wasn't his fault. You can't tell me Big B gives a shit about this. I'm sorry, Holly. I, I didn't know he put her down the witching well. 
Pickby cares, Holly. He's trying to help. And I'm sure he has a very good reason for being here. But this one isn't on him. Why are you here, anyway? And don't say it's because you care about this. Everything okay? I'm here to talk to Snow. Oh, really? Yes, Holly. This is serious. Okay, okay, look. Bigby and I are going to have a little chat far away from the ceremony, all right? Look, Holly, I know how this must... No, you don't know how this must feel. You have no idea. Don't fuck anything up. Don't bother anybody. And when the first sign of trouble comes, and it will come because you're a goddamn walking trap for it, I want you the fuck out of here. You hear me? Holly, I didn't even want to crash this, okay? I had to, because of snow. I'll be out of here soon. See that you are. Let's just continue, okay? This is such total fucking bullshit. Let's go, Holly. It's your turn to talk. Yeah, I don't know. This better be wildly important. It's been hard enough making a connection with these people. When you pull this kind of stuff, it just resets the clock. Snow, Crane is completely obsessed with you. Oh my god, if this is about how Crane treats me at work... Just I... listen to me for a second, alright? I followed a lead to this shithole motel, The Open Arms. Crane had a room there, and he's been taking prostitutes, or at the very least Lily, and making her look like you while he was... You know, he replays your story over and over again. This is... I don't even know what to say right now. I really don't. I'm just trying everything I can right now to not picture it. I'm sorry, Snow. And I'm sorry I had to be the one to tell you. You're sure this is what happened? This is what he's been doing? Because please, Bigby, don't confuse things. Deposing yeah, yeah. For so the photo. Let's be clear here. You took a cab here, right? Yeah. I'll drive. Snow, Narissa, what is it? I'm sorry, but Holly's asking for you. Are they starting the burn? Yes. Everyone who spoke should really be present for this part. She's kind of distraught. You're not leaving yet, are you? Two minutes. I don't mean to be... Um, no, I understand. Take your time. No, I get it. Take your time. It won't take long. Don't be a dick. How'd it go? At the motel? Did you find anything? No? It was Crane's room. But you knew that already, right? Nerissa! Yeah, um... Uh, coming! I'm gonna lie, it's a kind of... Constable? Wait, 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 easy now, girl. Oh boy. You know how this goes. The first thing in a visit, you say, how do you do? How do you do? That way, You're about to regret this. I tell you to run. It won't do any good. Just make it more fun for me. What are you dreaming about? You ain't a fast enough pup to prevent me from emptying both barrels into Snow White's face over there. We'll snip to the chase for all sakes. A little bird told us that you're fitting to go after Crane. And you see, we have an interest in that particular boy. So you leave Crane alone, and we'll leave you alone. Just take a little vacation. Oh, for the Don't even have to go anywhere. You work for Crane? Your office and whistle to heaven for a few short days. Are you working for Crane? Did he send you? No. See now, you're already asking too many questions. Just pay attention. So what's it gonna be? We have a deal. You leave Crane alone, and we leave you to yours. Brother. Speak your mind. 
fastly now. Find it to do. I'll leave Crane alone. Just get out of here. Pleasure to hear it. Ladies, gentlemen, I can lie at it, right? Please rest easy. This is not what's going on. What's happening? Very sorry to impose, but we only had a deal to work out with Bigby. And we're happy to report that everything went smoothly. So if you'll just allow us to get out of your hair. Bigby, what is he talking about? Never you mind that, it ain't any of your... What deal? They want me to leave Crane alone. Crane? Oh, now you shouldn't have done that, old boy. Really. That wasn't right, telling everyone our dealings. Oh no. What did I tell you? What did I say? Ali? You think you motherfuckers oh, no, can Ali's come out. here uninvited? You think you can just fucking interrupt Lily's funeral? Calm down, darling. It was just a simple business transaction. You fucking freaks are not getting away with this. I'll Ali, handle this. Don't move. Ali, let me handle this. Yeah, let's spare all the fuss. It's just a dead hole. I'm gonna kill you! Όχι. Thank God, όχι. Oh, μαλάκα, φάνηκε σαν headshot. Ένα από έναν hit the dust. Yeah, that's a, that's a, that's a start to an episode. <laughs> yeah. Καλησπέρα, είναι δύο νεκροί, μπαμ μπαμ! Πάρ' το, τι θα κάνεις τώρα. Σου γάμισε. Μια νεκρή ο άλλος κουνιόταν. Ναι, ισχύει ο άλλος κουνιόταν. Κρουκτ Μάιλ. Την έφαγε καλά όμω, δεν ξέρω πόσο δουλεύει η νέα. Θα ζήσει, ναι. I did as well as I could to take out the buckshot, but there's still some shards left embedded in your shoulder. They'll eventually warm their way out on their own, but until they do, you're going to be sore. Big B, Dr. Swinehart was appointed Fable Town physician for a reason. It's okay. There's only one thing you have to take away from all this. Take it easy. <clears throat> Don't go looking for any more fights. Keep strain off your heart. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm good. Is she? She's fine, Bigby. I had everyone that got wounded sent home. Damn boy, Molly he's refused fucked. to let me see where she lived. So I left her and Grendel back at her bar with a dose of juniper and spring water. Just remember what I said. The stitches won't hold up if you continue to act like you normally do. Everything in moderation. I'll try. And uh, eat more chicken. I'll try to. <laughs> All right then. Very good. Wolverine, look at motherfucker with that yeah, yeah, long ass here, yeah, motherfucker. I know. I'll have to call you back. You punk ass, yeah. Yeah. I'm starting to find out. Well, I'll leave you two to it then. Miss White, Big B. <laughs> Damn boy. So, I to told recap, you kind of. Crane watched me through the magic well, like mirror, a, uncover his room at well, the like door. He can't handle smashed me. it, so we couldn't use it ourselves to go out. Oh, I'm this. fucking coming! In the rafters. That about cover it. And once he puts all the pieces back together, it'll be easy to catch Crane. So, I go, guess that's oh the plan, God. apparently. But I, I don't know. We don't have time to wait for the mirror. Crane could be getting on a train right now. Well, I don't want to just go running off into the night without some direction. 
What the hell is going on? Just... I don't know what the Tweedles get out of this. I don't know if Crane sent them. I don't know if... I mean, this is gonna sound crazy, but do you really think Crane did it? Everything points to him. I get it, but do you really think he killed those women? Because it's just... It's incomprehensible to me. From what I saw at the open arms, everything points to Crane murdering Lily. What isn't adding up for me is Faith. Why would he kill her? It doesn't seem connected. Yeah, yeah. It, it doesn't make sense. He's... He was a conniver, a, a coward, a liar. And I'll always hate him for that. And I'll hate him for how he held me in his thoughts. But murdering prostitutes? Ow! Everything okay over there? Yes, Miss White. I just cut myself on a piece of the glass. Nothing to worry about. Thanks for tonight, by the way. That could have gone really terribly. I mean, even worse than it did. Any time. Damn, boy. Smooth. <laughs> Can I, um, ask you a question? Schmish? It's kind of personal. Schmish now? Schmish? And I don't want to offend you, but after tonight... Sure. It's just... When stuff hits the fan, like like it did tonight, it feels like before we came to the city, it feels kind of like home. And I've heard it said that maybe in some tiny little bottled up way deep inside, you kind of enjoy it when things go wrong. No, bits. Because it gives you an excuse to just, you know, Stop pretending. Fuck no, I don't enjoy it. Are you kidding me? It's horrible what happened tonight. I wish it didn't happen. I shouldn't have said anything. Forget that I did. Uh, guys? We have a problem. What is it? I can't finish the mirror. It's missing a piece. What do you Le mean? Comate. Missing a yeah. piece? Yeah. Yes, it's, uh... It's not here. Crane must have taken a shark. Oh, I can't believe this. I saw Crane pick something up after he smashed it. I'm sorry, I didn't realize what it was until now. Well, the mirror can't work unless it's whole. Well, that's not entirely true. Or what, what? Buffkin? What? We sit around and wait until it mends itself? We have no idea how long that will take. We're just gonna have to do this the hard way. I'm just saying, waiting is an option. No. We can't depend on the mirror. What exactly is the hard way? We'll look through his things, his desk, everything. He had to have left something that tells us where he's going. He's a neat freak, but he was never that smart. Smart enough to take a piece of the mirror. We can still solve this ourselves. I know never that Never mind that. Come help me look. Yeah. Mesh in the desk. Yeah, open the drawer, bitch. And I said, bitch. The office of business. Okay. Book. There's a page here that was torn out. Oh, yeah? Buffkin, do you know what was here? The, the it's a ring. ring, at least. Every magical item not retained in the armory is assigned to someone in Fable Town. It must be this witch he is going to see. Wait, what? What witch? What meeting? Well, he called up somebody. He said he needed to see his witch, or that he would need to get to the witch for that. Whoever that is. Well, yes, it sounded like the one he got his, uh, you glamours from. I'm sure it's about this ring. They must have it. Why not mention this before? No one asked me. Buffkin! <laughs> Come on, Buffkin. I'm sorry. Hungry. He set the meeting at 2 a.m. tonight. What's going on? Is the mirror fixed yet? Bluebeard, this isn't the time. Is the, the mirror the stream? Sad. You called I Rita. called just to see if you knew where Crane could be, and that was it, okay? 
And I'm sorry I said anything more than that. Well, you did, and I know. The cat's out of the bag. So, can we find the dull pervert or not? I tried this to, but... This isn't your concern. No, it can't be fixed. It's missing a piece. This is none of Bluebeard's business, Bigby. None of my business? Crane's the murderer. He escaped. It seems he spoiled your every attempt at locating him. And now it's none of my business? We don't know if he's the murderer. Oh, please. Of course he is. Look, this just isn't of the time. He took a piece of the mirror so we can't use it. The only thing we know is that Crane's going to see a witch at 2 o'clock. A.M. or P.M.? A.M. Listen, Bluebeard, you're not a part of this. I don't think you're in Wh any position to turn care? away help. Why do you even care about this? Why? I'm invested in this enterprise we call Fable Town. <laughs> Literally invested. Since it's mostly my money that keeps the whole thing running. And tonight I hear that Crane has been killing Fables? <laughs> and there's no system in place to catch him? Look. We know that Crane is going to see a witch, and it's to acquire a magic ring. What's the ring? We don't know what it does or who it's assigned to since Crane tore its page out of the book. This farce was your ridiculous idea for a plan. I mean, who put you in charge in the first place? Fixing the mirror was the most logical You're thing. You're a secretary. He's the sheriff. And none of you were chosen to run this office. Who elected you to make these decisions? Nobody, but that Who doesn't... elected her to spend my money? Well, I've been doing that unofficially for years. Snow can obviously handle this, so let's drop it. Well then, excuse me for having the Commonwealth in mind. <sighs> All right, let's just look on the bright side. We know Crane is going to see the witch that's been supplying him black market glamours. Thanks to me. And... That he'll be there at two. So that gives us a few short hours to find out who it is and where they live and get them all at once. And a few shorter hours the more you babble about it. We haven't been the ones babbling. Since Lily used the glamours, she'd have known who the witch was. Like and skins, I don't think yeah. Carl's burned her things yet. It would probably have the address or a phone number or something. And Bigby is free to go there if he likes. But I think the question you should be asking is just what do the two Tweedles know about this? It doesn't matter what they know. After tonight, they'd never go to their office. They're not smart enough to try and go anywhere else. The Trip Trap is the better option to track the witch down. Even if they're not there, the Tweedles' office might have something on Crane. We're the witch. I don't really care what you two do. I'm going to his apartment. What? You can't just go up there. And why the hell not? We already looked for the key, remember? I don't know where it is. Then I'll pick the blasted lock. Anyone can be everyone. <sighs> I've wasted Basically. enough time waiting for the mirror to find him. I won't waste any more. You just can't go up there alone, all right? I've no interest in nicking his drapes, my dear, if that's what concerns you. What concerns me is you traipsing through possible evidence. Oh, now it's evidence. Before you had no interest, and now it's a crime scene. Bluebeard, just stay out of it, all right? You'll just mess things up further. I can't get any more messed up. We have to find the witch, Bluebeard, since that's where he's going. Or oh, the sniveling weasel chickened out. Never went anywhere. And is upstairs right now in his pitiful penthouse, crafting a fort out of couch cushions. Look, this is how a smart person would do it. So this is how we're going to do it. Wherever you go, I'll go to the other. I don't like you going anywhere unsupervised. He's up to something. I don't know what it is, but we don't have the time to really worry about it now. Okay. Where are you gonna go, Bigby? Good night, good night, good night, Jim. Το είπε λετζής στα μούτρα του μπροστά, ξέρω εγώ. Πού να πάω. So you leave Crane alone, and we leave you alone. I'd love to join you, but there's some business I need to attend to. No, no, I'm better off dealing with things alone. Εγώ θα πήγαινε στο Crane, καρφί. Oh. Crane's apartment. Πού λες να πάμε. <coughs> Αν κάποιος ξέρει το που είναι... Like, ποιο... I mean, 
και το apartment του μπορεί να έχει πράγματα δηλαδή, και να έχει το Wiggity Witch, αλλά αν κάποιο ξέρει ποιο που είναι ο τύπο, αλλά δηλαδή, σίγουρα δεν παίρνει να μιλήσει, είναι η Deez. Mm. Το apartment είναι πιο promising νομίζω. Κι εγώ έτσι νομίζω. Από το να Έλα, πάμε να ξαναμιλήσουμε στου τύπου. Ο τύπο ήταν δεμένο και τον έδερνε και δεν μιλούσε. Yeah. Like, like δεν νομίζω θα μιλήσει τώρα. Αλλά ξέρει κάτι. Το Bartis Hall είναι πολύ. Τελευταία λύση, ναι. Crane's penthouse number is 1903. Let me know if you can. Crypto. Good night, boy. Night. Right, I walk? Okay, I walk. I walk, I smash. Smash? Smash door? I smash now? Snow said Crane lives in 1903. <laughs> Open. Carfe. Crane? I can't call out either way. <laughs> Damn it. Must have missed him. There's gotta be it's something about his witch okay. here. Can I figure it out? Then I find the bottom of his anecdote. Well, there's only one way to find out. This hasn't been used in years. Merry Christmas, Mr. Green. Thank you for all. I forgot. He used to teach in the old days. Okay. Answering machine, yeah. Sure, that looks promising. Crooked man. This is all I could get. I'm afraid Snow will start to notice. 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 Use a fucking wish. My dearest Snow, I know you must be aware of this. Peter, start your telephone. That's a tip for a film. Be done, Archidi. It's just that I'm not work. I felt the telephone that was going to pan into Lily. Because I love you. Clithy, can't stop it. I lost my spot. A lot of things I said. The guy. Might be useful. Okay, I have a key. Pog. Νομίζω ότι κάτι θα με τρομάξει τώρα. Το διάολο! I've never seen him that excited. Guess things have changed. Math, science, history. I had to guess. This shit didn't work. Okay, okay. Can I go anywhere else? Bedroom. Okay, 
Okay, well, there's got to be an easier way. Oh, use key? Grab him. Jack? Wow, it is just unbelievable running into you here. I mean, of all the places. This weather, right? A little Bruh. damp, I guess. But you know, some people like that sort of thing. Don't play dumb. I'm running very low on patience tonight. Okay, okay, okay. I know what it looks like, but before you go jump into conclusions, Crane pays me to water his plants when he's gone. It's a stipend, but you know I need the work. I wouldn't do it for free, right? You know me. So, anyways, uh, now that I'm done... I don't see any plants. Hey! Okay! You got me. Just take it easy. I don't like being lied to. Okay, okay. I heard Crane was leaving town. I figured he owed us little people a parting gift. Or just me a parting gift. You heard? I have my sources, okay? You see how he lives. He doesn't need any of this shit. What sources? Have you heard this from? What does it matter? I hear things. What else do you want me to say? I got bills to pay. Not like Crane's gonna use any of this stuff. Did somebody send you and tell the truth? No, it's just me. Just take it easy. No, I won't know. Yeah, blah, 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 You know, this tortured, lonely pig eater bit's gonna get old eventually. Don't you get tired of it? I mean, what are you even doing here? Are you just wandering around Crane's apartment? I mean, what's the point? I'm investigating. Sure. Well, looks like you've got it covered. Anyway, it was really nice catching up with you. I mean that. Bigby, I believe you're uh, blocking the doorway there. If I could just uh, squeeze through. You know, on second thought, it's actually funny I ran into you like this. I think I can help you out. I may not know why you're here, but... I'm listening. Go on. I'm listening. Look, I have some dirt on Crane you might be interested in. Word on the street says he's got a witch in the city. I oh. can tell you who she is, <laughs> if you're interested. Oh. Information comes at a price, though. But I'm sure you already knew that. All right. Tell me. Let's make ourselves a deal. I tell you about Crane's witch, and you forget you saw me here. One hand washes the other sort of thing. Wipe the whole incident hmm. under the rug. Come deal. On. Deal. Fine. You got a deal. Perfect. Now tell me where I can find this witch. Strong grip. Her name is Auntie Greenleaf. Crane's been trying to keep it under wraps for years. I'm not sure what he's using her for, but if he's not going to the 13th floor, it's gotta be something illegal. How reliable is this information? You sure you have the right name? Absolutely. Without a doubt. Uh, th the thing is, I... Don't know where you'd find her exactly. You gotta be fucking kidding me. But even a name is a good start, right? I mean, that's more than what you came in with. Yeah, she's right. Right. I'll keep my eyes open for you. If I find anything else you might be interested in, I'll be sure to let you know. I think this arrangement can be beneficial to both of us down the line. Ah, <sighs> it was just lovely running into you. Hang on a second. Oh, come yeah, on. of course. Yeah, that's okay. I'm moving the blue. Yeah. Hmm. 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 The white deer. Do you always talk to yourself like that? The witch uses the white deer on everything. It's her symbol or trademark, I guess. Figured I could sell these at the Lucky Pawn. Lucky Pawn? It's one of the crooked man's places. I work there sometimes. When I need some stability. It's a pawn shop. Get it? Yeah, yeah. 
You find any more of these? Uh, no. You seem nervous. You nervous about something? What do you mean? Look me in the eye and tell me you didn't steal anything else. Come on, Jack. Is that it? Take me? Are you still here? We're in here, Snow. We? Who else is... What's he doing here? Evening, Miss White. Good evening. What's going on? Jack? Well, since Bigby seems to have lost his ability to speak, I'll be happy to explain. I'm here to offer my services. What does that mean? I had some information about Crane and his witch I thought the business office might be interested in. Oh. What did you find out? Her name is Greenleaf. Auntie Greenleaf. But he doesn't know where we can find her. Great. Crane's meeting her at 2 a.m. And Snow, I found a note with some money attached. Crane has been embezzling from Fable Town. <sighs> of course, because why half-ass being a complete sleazeball? Do you think this is tied to the murders? I mean, I guess it doesn't matter yet. It's, it's probably connected. I think it's connected. Maybe the girls found out about it? I don't know. Mm, maybe? Crane's meeting Greenleaf at 2 a.m. And we have no idea where she is. We're going to cut it close as it is. We have to figure out where he's meeting her. Wouldn't she be listed in the business office? I've had Buffkin searching for any unauthorized witches, but so far we haven't found anything. I'll give him the name, but we don't have time to wait around. You should try Holly's. She still has all of Lily's things. If she hasn't burned it already. There's still Tweedledee's place. We know they're involved. And we know that's where Bluebeard went. Where do you want to go? We don't have much time. Πάμε με το trip trap ή this and that on the office. Το trip trap περισσότερα θα μας βγάλει. Πιστεύω. Νομίζω ότι το office θα μας βγάλει πιο πολλά γιατί οι τύποι δουλεύουν γι' αυτόν. Well... Το να πάμε στο bar της Molly δεν θα μας βγάλει κάτι. Ναι. Ότι είχε πάνω της η τύπη σαν το βρήκα με το πτώμα της. Yeah, you're right. Tweedle brothers a visit. I'm sure they know something. I mean, boy, nice cat is so sweet. I'll give Buffkin a name and hope he finds something in the room. I'll be in touch. I'll be in touch. I'll be in touch. I hope you'll do the same. We'll catch him, Snow. Hang on, Jack. I want to talk to you. Oh boy. Oh boy, Samathi. I'm sorry, big guy. You can't come in. Yeah, yeah, because the thing is, and I don't know if you'd heard, but I'm a third degree black belt and, uh, you know, whatever. So I wouldn't take any chances, hombre. Last guy who messed with me got his marbles kicked right through his abdomen, all right? <clears throat> Excuse me. Oh. Hi, Sheriff. Flycatcher. What happened what here? You here? What the hell happened? I'll have it cleaned up soon. I'm, I'm sorry. Bluebeard was here. He was looking for something. I don't know what. He said it was an official investigation. But how was I supposed to know if he was telling the truth? When I wouldn't let him in... Shit. Found what he was looking for, I guess. It's just super annoying. I just finished cleaning. What did he take? I don't know what he wanted. I, I didn't see what he did after... I'm really sorry, Big B. He's a nice guy. Was he telling the truth? He said you sent him, but I don't know. I just thought he was lying. I'm not supposed to just let people in here, but then he got mad, saying, oh, just terrible things. He was lying. I didn't send him here. You did the right thing. Okay. Good. Oh, I'm going to get fired. Crane already let me go from the woodlands. Is that why you're here? He said I just got in the way. Told me to get lost. The twins offered me a job here working the night shift, so I'd have something. What do I do now? It's nice, you know, quiet. I come in and clean up. They're usually pretty nice. Talk to Snow. You should talk to Snow. Maybe there's something she can do for you. Really? That would be thank you. Look, I'm running out of time. 
Oh boy. Oh, shit. Is everything okay? I gotta go. What? Where? I'm headed to the trip trap. Just uh trip trap is in the game. Tell what's happened, okay? Can you do that for me? Okay, I, I guess. Oh, well. And I'll ask her about that job, all right? Sure, sure. Take care of yourself, Fly. You too, Sheriff Bigby. What a nice guy. I really, I, I really like him. Sarà da pet minutes left. <laughs> He's asleep, you fucking idiot. He didn't even give me a chance to explain. What's left to explain? We're closed. I need to talk to Holly. Hey, look, Woody, it's the sheriff. Zee, holy. Come on in, buddy. Mm, keep it jealous. Friend, what? He's a traveler. A Just weary a traveler in search yeah, of yeah, some yeah. hospitality, right? Yeah, sure. Thanks. I want a drink. Anybody else want a drink? my leg. Friend, Swinehart said you shouldn't mix you it. You think I give a fuck what that fucking guy says? Or what you say? Grant, really, you, you shouldn't drink right now. You should quit while you're ahead with that stuff. I might need your help. Holly's asleep in back, but you won't be able to wake her. Really? The doc gave him both barmesidal ambrosia for the pain. Look, the deal is, if you resist going to sleep, like I am right now, it gives you a very, very, very nice high. Toothpaste <laughs> Cassiola. <laughs> said that he shouldn't mix it with alcohol. Nice high, bro. Wow, nice high. Yes, he did. He certainly did. Well, let me tell you something. I haven't felt this good in a long time, fat boy. There's no way to wake her up. Oh, no. Anyways, the doctor gave me strict orders to let the fine woman sleep. She's had a very traumatic experience. That funeral back there? That was a shitty fucking send-off for a pretty okay lady. Yeah. You weren't fucking there. I'm talking to Bigby now, okay? Can't say you being there helped things much. Gren, don't start nothing. Who's starting anything? You think I shot up the place? It wasn't my fault. They got away though, didn't they? Whatever. It's all right. I'm too out of it to get into it. I want to clear the air. We're all in this dung heap of a fucking shit town together. We're all gonna have a toast. All of us. Fellas, I'm here for one thing. To look through Lily's belongings and get out of here. Now, yeah, right? yeah, I know, I know. And I want to help you, okay? And I will. But first, indulge me. It'll take two seconds. Okay, so... A show of good faith. And after, we'll all hunt and peck for Lily's shit or whatever. Grand Bigby didn't come here to get loaded with you. I don't want to get loaded with him. Sure. To the dead. All right, now help me. Grand. The doc said you needed to rest. How many times are you fucking gonna warn me about it, huh? You're not my fucking mother, so just get off my back! I said I was sorry, all right? I can't do anything about it, it's done! <laughs> what more do you want, 
What else can I fucking say here? Cut this shit out now. I don't care what it's about. Oh, I forgot. You haven't heard the news. This walking lard cake was paying Holly's sister to let him fuck her behind all of our backs. And Holly had to find out going through all of her sister's shit. What fun that must have been. Trick after trick of this fat ass and Lily. I didn't plan for that, all right? And our thing, whatever it was, it wasn't a big deal. It wasn't. I never fucked her when she was snowing. I didn't know nothing about that. No, but you knew Holly would flip out. And you knew for a damn good fucking reason. You know what? Fuck this. I don't need this shit. Oh yeah, that's it. Now you're teary-eyed. You were always such a lowlife. I don't know why I never realized it till now. What do you think about this fucking loser, Sheriff? He can think whatever he wants. I don't give a shit. No, that's okay, because I'll tell you what he thinks. He thinks you have to pay chicks to touch your fat, hairy ass. That's what he thinks. Oof. That's the, 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 then, the, it, it's not my place to talk. Then we have to lose him and I'm going to that, yeah. I don't know where Lily's shit is. <sighs> Check Holly's room, I don't know. But I wouldn't wake her if I were you. Sleepwalkers and trolls. I think that's the role. Maybe, uh, ogres too. I thought you said you would help me look. Actually, Big B, if you'll excuse me, it seems that I'm gonna pass out. What a day. Am I right, Sheriff? What a fucking day. The Gren won't remember this. <laughs> Gren totally won't remember this. <laughs> Shit, fuck. <laughs> no, don't wake her. Is there anything else? Damn boy, that they f they f <sighs> that you, Woody? <sighs> Woody, is that you? No, Holly, it's me, Big B. Big B, boss closed. And excuse me, but I'm not in the mood for entertaining. But what the fuck? I know you're not gonna leave. You do what you want. You always do what you want. <laughs> do you even give a shit about us? The strays? The ones that aren't in that fancy high-rise. Those of us that gotta work for a living. Holly, just because I live in the woodlands doesn't mean I'm not one of your strays. I'm not Crane or Cole. I didn't exactly grow up wearing clothes. Yeah. Yeah, I know you didn't. Hmm. Why do you even come here? There's nothing here to investigate. I can't be any use to you. I'm just 
I'm tracking a lead. Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Op, auto. Eh, uh, there's a book. Tirafi. Το wine ρε, μισό ρε μαλάκα, όλα πρώτα Όλα, όλα θα τα δούμε Be honest, Sheriff Why are you going after him? The guy that killed Lily You could have quit a long time ago But you're still going Why? Did they give you this job for a reason? Or was this the only thing the business office would let you do? I'm doing this for Lily. She deserves whatever justice I can get her. I'll take it. You were getting your glamour on this day. One of these has to be the witch. Yeah. Anti Greenleaf. Brooklyn, the Matthew has to lose all the story. Pian Refis. Snow White calling. I'm looking for Bigby. To the other end of the woods. Bigby, hey, there, pick up, okay? Hey, in the bay. Snow. Oh, my God. Hey, boy. Hey, in the boy. Bad boy. Her address was here. All these things. It's on uh, White yeah, Plains Avenue, 1284. <laughs> it's an apartment complex. Bye. Right. Let's get going. All right, let's go. I don't want to miss him. I'll meet you there. All right, I'll see you there. Pork, we did it. Big B, I just got here. Yeah, me too. It's number 23. I haven't seen it yet. We're late. Yeah, I know. Well, this is it. Well, as far as women, right. he wants for others to just keep in the hair. Yeah. How do you want to do this? Smash. Wait, 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 wait. What are you doing? What does it look like? Don't just kick it in. We don't know what's on the other side. Let's just save the last resort for last. Fine. Fine, okay. What would you have me do instead? I don't know. Knock? I mean, we have no idea what's behind this. More guys. Hello. Hi. You woke me up. Uh, sorry about that. Is something wrong? Who are you? Rachel, who are you? Just so... Well, I'm the sheriff. And this is my partner. Boss. Pleased to meet you. How do you do? Is there, um, is there anything you need? Is Auntie Greenleaf at home? Does she live here? You mean my mom? She ever, you know, make the nightstand levitate, turn frogs into cats, that kind of thing? Is she a witch, dear? No, I would never call my mommy that. She treats me all right. Is there uh, something you want? I don't think I can really help you. Rachel, do you mind if I take just a quick peek around? We'll be very quick, and he won't touch anything. Well, she didn't answer. Well, she's the witch. I've been here all night. Nobody's been here. Huh. <laughs> okay, she, she's I'm gonna the witch. trust you not to break anything. Don't get me in trouble. What are we looking for specifically? Crane, you could still be here. Well, record player, a little no, kid. No, it's been over all night, so he's just going to check. It'll only take a moment. That your mom? Uh huh. Yeah, I don't know, dude. Your I don't mom know, no. Hunter. Oh no, she never. That was found in the woods around Dick's Mountain, I think. Huh. So, we don't give a fuck about that. Where I do you buy your clothes? At a store? Oh. My 
not here. There's no one here but me. Talk. How much longer do you think it'll be? Let's check the room. Slap here, I can't. Delivered one day green, green leaf. Hmm. Butcher. What's that? A package having to do with someone called the Butcher. It's empty. There's nothing that looks like Crane was here either. Nothing? See? Well, let's check everything. I saw a spider over there yesterday. Oh? It was a pretty one. Let me guess. Big band or classical? Honky tonk. No accounting for taste. Do you like broccoli? It's pretty rare to see a burner like this. <sighs> Dowdy. That's how we like it. Do you have any pets? Not technically. What is this? Mommy uses that to carve her trinkets. It's from the old world. Trinkets? Um, like glamours? God damn it. I shouldn't say that. Nothing. I keep getting whiffs of that aftershave of his. I do too. Can I go to bed now, please? Is that a glamour tube? Mommy really doesn't let anyone play with that. Trust me, I tried. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, 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 just put that back exactly where you found it. No one is allowed to play with it's that. It's all right, honey. Bigby's not going to break no, it. you don't understand. She will freak out if she discovers I've let people in here and let them touch her stuff, okay? She checks all the time to see if things move. I don't want to get in trouble. I'm not going to break it. I just want to open it. No! Put it down! Please, don't! This isn't what you think! you got to believe me. The guy isn't here, I promise! It's going to be okay, Rachel. Please, I'm begging you. I don't want to... I don't want to get in trouble. <laughs> Anti-green leaf. It hey. hurts when you do it that fast. Bitch. <laughs> you think we have time to waste on this shit? Think this is some kind of game? No, I don't. But congratulations on winning it, if that matters to you. All right, start explaining. And from the beginning. Where's Crane? Speak quickly. I ain't a fortune teller, Wolf. I have no heavenly idea where he went to. You have to know something. Unless you want a recipe for owl stew. Just why in the name of everything holy are you protecting this weaselly scumbag? I mean, what on earth could he have done to deserve this kind of loyalty? Crane could be hollow bones tomorrow, and you wouldn't see me cry a drop. But that doesn't mean I can tell you anything. You have friends, don't you? Well, I don't want Crane's friends for enemies. Please, Greenleaf. Crane is a murderer and he's escaping. You might want to check your facts on that. My facts? It doesn't matter. I can't help you. I have no interest oh? in being turned into a skink and crushed under boot heels. There's powers at work here beyond your pathetic authority. Whatever it is, Greenleaf, Whatever it is that's keeping you from saying something, you should be a lot more afraid of me than whatever horseshit you think will come back to bite you. You have no idea what's going on, do you? Okay, you know what I think? I think we've been more than patient with you. This witch has been selling illegal glamours that continue to undermine everything we've built. She's harboring a fugitive that took advantage of it, and now she's resisting every attempt to make things right. I frankly don't give a crap. If she's afraid for her life, we can at least make sure she never hurts us again. We're destroying the tree. No! How 
dare you come in here and threaten to take from me the one thing that... That tree is ancient. It's part of the family, and it's the only thing paying for this shithole apartment. And the Fables, who can't afford the glamours from you, come to me for help. Without them, where do you think they could go? Don't give me that. You're making money off of other people's misery. Two Fables are dead because of this crap. It's too dangerous leaving this stuff with her. You think I like being the old woman in these stories? The men are heroes, the ladies are whores, and the old hags like me get to watch everyone they love die. We have very different ways of handling our fate. Very different means to handle it, too. And I don't use it as an excuse to wreck people's lives. Isn't there another way? She's a witch. Can't she just work for us? That way she'd be official. You want to reward her for criminal behavior? We can't trust this woman on the 13th floor. It doesn't matter, because I'd never do it. I'm not a house cat, and I don't play well with others. Oh, trust me, no one would confuse you for a cuddly animal. Bigby, this is an order. Burn the tree. No! Look, look, I'll tell you, I'll tell you. Crane was here. He was here, and he left. He went to the pudding and pie to try to use my ring on the girls over there to get information. What does the ring do? He thinks it's the ring of dispel. You know, that it will pierce the protection around the girl's speech. He says pulling the truth out of them will prove his innocence. It won't, though. Damn thing lost its power decades ago. I'm sorry, but we still can't let you keep the tree. It wouldn't be right after what's happened. Big B. Please, Sheriff. Don't. Okay, well, I guess I see where I stand with you. All right, let's go. Hey, Greenleaf. Don't think this is over. I won't. I mean... Δεν μου πήγαινε η καρδιά να το κάψε ρε μαλάκα, μόλις μας μίλησε Θα ήταν πολύ dick move Δεν είναι και να το κάψε, αλλά και πάλι χρησιμοποιείται για άσχημα πράγματα Well... Come to audition, you bitch. Fuck you. Fucking fuck, man. Tell me what you know now. Malaka. You can't just go in there. We have a problem. Yeah, we have a problem. Mr. Crane, please, she can't help. I know you know what the plan is. I won't be held accountable for this. Oh my God, beat me. We don't. I, I, I didn't do anything. I promise you, I didn't do anything. These girls, the, the, the girls, they'll back me up. I j just have to get the stupid ring working. That's all. They can't talk because of that spell. But once this ring gets through, I'll know what's going on and this whole thing will be over. That's all. Please. I'm innocent. Completely, completely innocent. It's just... Just let me show you. This will solve everything. I, I went to... You... Damn you. Come on. Please. Tell me who killed her! My lips are sealed. Wait, he, he was framed? <laughs> How many years? <laughs> what? How many years has this been going on? Too... Too many. But... I didn't kill those women, Bigby. Please, I had nothing, nothing to do with that. I just, I, it just. Oh God! We found the hobos. Photos of you and Lily. 
I know, I know. That's, that was, I just... I just love you, Snow. I love, I love you, and, and I'm sorry I'm not Prince Charming, okay? I'm sorry I didn't cheat on you and run away to Europe. You don't love me, Crane. I know what this is. I've seen it before. It is not love. Well, Bigby, I don't think he did it. What? Look at him. Do you really think this man murdered these women? He's not, he wouldn't be brave enough oh. not to put his stamp on the world like that. What do you mean? You don't think he did it at all? If you'd seen the room... I don't need to see the room. There's a lot he has to answer for. There's a lot we all have to answer for. This is different, Snow, and you know it. You said you found evidence of him defrauding Fable Town, of using our money for his own ambitions. That's one thing. But don't you have doubts he's a murderer? We've both known him for so long. I can't believe I'm hearing this. Did you see how he was acting when you showed up? This fuck up knows more than he's saying. I don't. I don't! Uh, yes, okay, he probably does. But there's a difference between being involved and being the guy who did it. Okay, but if Crane didn't kill Faith and Lily, I'm sorry, but who the hell did? You know, when I saw you come back here... This whole thing is bigger than Crane. He wouldn't have the stones to send the Tweedles after me. Somebody else is involved. Well, shit. I didn't intend for any of this to get so... You've been stealing money from Fabletown for years, haven't you? Yeah. We're not gonna kill you, so quit your shivering. Ichabod Crane, you are under arrest for the misappropriation of Fabletown funds. You have the right to counsel, the right to depose witnesses, but as of right now, you're coming with us. You are extraordinarily lucky Miss White was here to save your ass. As if it was up to me. You have your head swinging from the Washington Bridge. Okay, Sheriff, that's enough. This can't be Greenleaf again and I'm, I'm, again. Behaving how I mean, like acting without constraint. You have to respect this office, Bigby. And you have to respect me as its leader. Starting now. You think you have what it takes to run that office? You think I didn't make sacrifices? I made sacrifices. Yeah, it's snow. And you won't be in that chair one minute before you have to give up something you care about just so the wheels don't fall off the goddamn wagon. I did the best I could with what I had. And the town took everything it could out of me. Yeah, see, the thing of it is, we're better at this than you are. What are you saying? Oh boy, it's going to get ugly. Probably drive by. <laughs> Who the fuck Hi. is that? What you got there?
Look, it's recently come under our attention that you're... How shall I put this? Attempting to claim what is the personal property of the Crooked Man. He's about yay high, 120 odd pounds. Kissed his sheets until he was 14. Sound familiar? I haven't told him anything. Not now, not now. Shh. The grown-ups are talking. Who are you? No, 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 no. That's not how this works. How this works is you are going to walk Crane over here. Like a good doggy. It wasn't my fault. <clears throat> Shut up. You're interfering with official Fabletown business. Step aside. Tweedledee. What's the, uh, you know, that thing the Mondays call me? Wha what? My nickname. You know what I'm talking about. Uh, Bloody Mary. Bloody Ma Mary, that's it. Thank you. And do you know why they call me that? Because some of them, they think it's funny to have their little sleepovers and go into their little bathrooms and say my name five times in the mirror. They find it less funny when I actually show up and feed their lungs to the family dog. And I do that for a hobby. Like golf, to relax. Fuck off. You can fuck off if you think you're getting him. I told you he'd never just give him up. Yep. Fight me, bitch. You made the wolf angry. You made the wolf angry. Kill him? I just didn't know when to end. Oh, to ask to tell you. You know, you didn't think silver bullets would work on anything but a pure werewolf. You're but faster than I think. Yeah, I'm faster than you think. Right, Wolfie? I mean, hey, look, I know it sounds ridiculous, but really, guys, <laughs> he 
Can't you argue with these results? Because I know I can't. Wait! Stop! But I, I pressed the two. Just take him, okay? Take Crane. Just stop, please. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Snow, uh, stay out of this. The crooked man. It's your lucky day, kid. The crooked man says it's okay with him. Hello, Ichabod. Got a stomach ache? Oh, and just between us girls? Crane ain't no killer. I mean, look at his face. Couldn't stick a pig if his life depended. Kinda like your boyfriend here. Too pussy to ruin a Tweedlestay. Well, this is gonna be a beautiful relationship we have with you guys. Really, I mean it. I'm jazzed about it. Out with the old, in with the new. Long with the queen. I'm sure we'll be in touch. See you around. Damn. He's lucky to be alive, and he won't be next time if he keeps going like this. This is getting worse by the minute. We don't have time to sit around and wait for their next move. I'll get things under control. Woody, I'm not gonna tell you again. Back off, dog. This doesn't concern you. What do you want to talk about? I just wanted to, um, about last night. After what they did to you, are you even gonna be able to stop them? Don't hold out on me, Jack. You've always got some angle. Not this time. I know when a mark's not worth the trouble. Do you? Don't make me come down there to deal with you. I don't want it. You don't want it. <laughs> then again, you don't have much choice at this point, do you? 